Hey there everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here and I'm here to review the Spongebob episode Fiasco requested by Golden Cookie. So Fiasco is about when Squidward's favorite artist Fiasco makes an artful masterpiece on a plate and so everyone admires this masterpiece of art from this artist but Plankton as usual tries to steal the Krabby Patty secret formula but instead of him taking the actual Krabby Patty he mistakenly takes the piece of art by Fiasco in which Plankton is not aware of so now Plankton's on the run because he has the stolen art so I'm going to be honest with you guys, I thought Fiasco was just okay. Um, I think it was a missed opportunity. I think it could have been a lot better. For what the episode was, I was entertained enough, I thought it was enjoyable enough, but I thought there could have been more to the episode. The best part by far with this episode is once you hit to the second act of the episode when you see the cops chasing after Plankton. That is by far the funniest part of the episode and really the most memorable moment of this episode because the episode as a whole really is not that memorable. I also do like the opening of this episode when you see pretty much the Krusty Krab commercial because in the beginning of the episode, SpongeBob is pitching his idea through the storyboard drawings on how to do this Krusty Krab commercial, which Mr. Krabs did not approve, but I really thought that was cool how the episode opened up with this Krusty Krab commercial idea that Spongebob had. And Fiasco, it's good to see him make his second appearance. I mean, he made his debut appearance in that episode, Are You Happy Now? And it was cool how not too long ago we get to see him again. He's only in this episode briefly. He appears briefly in the beginning and appears briefly again at the end. But I thought Fiasco, for both of his cameo appearances, it was really funny and really entertaining. So I think this episode did have a good idea behind it. The problem with this episode is that it wasn't quite sure what it wanted to be exactly. I mean, this episode felt real jumpy in my opinion. At one moment you have Spongebob with his Krusty Krab idea and then another moment it's Fiasco making his work of art. Another moment everyone's admiring it. And then another moment that's when Plankton's on a run. I just felt like the episode was lost and it felt really unbalanced because I really felt like the events that happened in this episode it really wasn't balanced and by the time the episode does end it kind of does give me that um, that's it feeling. I like the thinking hat gag that was in this episode when Squidward told Spongebob to go put on your thinking hat. That was totally unexpected right there. And then Fiasco. But I did think the episode did start off pretty dull. And then also, when you see Fiasco, how did Squidward not recognize him right away? I, I just thought it was weird how Squidward didn't realize it was Fiasco until he saw his work of art on that plate. Also, why was Squidward in jail? at the end of the episode. I know it's meant for a comedic gag, but it just didn't make sense considering Squidward didn't do anything wrong. And the final problem I did have is that regarding the whole unbalanced thing, the plot to this episode feels way too thin. There's nothing wrong with this episode being simple because Spongebob does have a lot of simple episodes, except those other simple episodes I think handle it way better than this one because this episode just doesn't really know what to really truly focus on and like I said it just feels jumpy in terms of all of the events that are happening throughout this episode which really isn't much when I'm personally thinking about it but overall Fiasco is entertaining some of the humor is really well done and really funny I think the episode does have a lot of effort I think it has the right idea but it just didn't quite know how to explore this idea exactly so while there was effort, I think personally Fiasco is a missed opportunity. So I'm going to give Fiasco a 6 out of 10. So everyone, in the comments down below, let me know. What did you think of the episode Fiasco? This is 22 Tiger Dude here. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.